My name is Dr. Amy Harwick. I'm a marriage and family therapist. Specifically, I specialize in human sexuality. I work in private practice in West Hollywood, California, and I work with individuals, couples, families, and even children. I believe that sexy sizes, activity, um, exercise with a partner, uh, it really does increase overall intimacy. And when I say intimacy, I don't mean only sexualized intimacy. Intimacy is that closeness between two people. So that can mean even a bond through friendship. Platonic intimacy is also important. When you're in a close relationship with any person, you have to be able to trust that person. You have to be able to be close with them, maintain eye contact, be able to have human touch and feel comfortable. Sexy sizes and other types of exercise that require a partner help to increase that overall intimacy that you might have with a friend, a relative, or even an intimate partner. If you'd like more information about me, if you'd like to contact me about therapy, speaking, writing, anything like that, you can feel free to contact me on my website, which is dramyharwick.com. I'm also on all the social medias, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter as Dr. Amy Harwick. Hi, my name is Christina Engelhardt, also known as Angelhardt. I'm an Intuit life coach and a certified love coach. And if I look back at my evolution of becoming a life and a love Intuit coach, most importantly is being with the mind and the body together, still incorporating with another person, and of course opening your heart. You open your muscles, you open your mind, you open your body, and then comes the real healing. And the best part is the yoga, because when you add your body with another person, I think that is where the real connection comes in. So your eyes are open, you're looking at each other, you're feeling a real connection. And now when I say the word into it, I use, for example, astrology, all the metaphysical arts to kind of get a blueprint of what makes a person tick, what makes them compelled to another person, and what makes a love relationship find its bonds. So if it's earth or water or fire, you bring that all together. Now, what is the art that incorporates this in the physical exercise? Yoga. Yoga, stretching, exercising. You are connecting with all the chakras. You are connecting with your mind, body, and spirit. And imagine if you bring that together with another human being that you actually love, like, well, then your sex appeal just grows and you become a more loving person. Now that sounds pretty elementary, but it does take intuition to see that kind of energy between two people, how a real love affair can get closer, higher, by the art of love, sex, yoga. It is that intimacy, something that we are losing nowadays more and more with so much technology taking away from intimacy. My goal, our goal, is to have love open up heart to heart, body to body, and then some real love can happen. If you're interested in any of my Intuit coaching, I can be reached at christinaengelhart.com. I'll take a look at charts. I'll always be there to be a guide to people to fall truly in love.
Yeah.